How do you think the Ukraine-Russia war will end? I unfortunately predict. USA leaving NATO under Republicans. Under funding for Ukraine war effort. Russia taking the LEN. It currently has plus a little more and Russia offers the world no more war. Once the Western world accepts the new land is now Russian. Once this war is over the next big news headlines is depopulation for many countries. Crazy declining birth rates happening right now. Older people live longer on pension. Not enough workforce to support them. Advertise for immigrants to support the healthcare service and we start the whole cycle again. Unfortunately, I believe the West will grow tired of funding Ukraine eventually and will coerce them into agreeing to some kind of peace agreement. Ukraine will likely lose big chunks of territory. Perhaps what's left of Ukraine will be allowed to join NATO or the EU. Either way, Russia will lay low for a while, maybe even get some sanctions dropped, while they'll rebuild their forces. In a couple of years they'll either attack Ukraine again or some other unlucky country. It is impossible to say. But Russia won't take Ukraine. The war will last a long time, but at their current rate of losses Russia will run out of people before Ukraine. And even if that change Putin will keep going requiring parts of NATO to join in which will push Russia out of Ukraine. Either way both Ukraine and Russia lose their status as developed nations and will never again from where they were bequaced both of their demographics are too bad. It's complicated. The West especially Europe can't allow Russia to come out of this war with any gained territory because it will embolden Russia and make the West look weak. Russia can't allow the war to end with no territorial gains because it will be political suicide for Putin. The only way it could end would be for Putin to die. Until then, they will keep going at it and more lives will be lost from both sides. E meet grinder until they gain full control of the territories they annex. The two countries negotiate a settlement where Russia keeps those territories, but the Ukrainians are allowed to join NATO. The post-war future of both countries looks a lot like North versus South Korea. IDK. This rides on the presumption that Putin is more rational than he likely actually is. Situation if they do that Ukraine doesn't want any of its territory taken away from it. And the conflict will continue, and the Western powers will continue to send more weapons to further the conflict. The same way the Israel-Palestine war. Either complete annihilation of the defending country, or a complete reinterpretation of international law. Not respect America's veto right. Which Americans will use that as justification to trigger the Hague Invasion Act switching the Cold War into a hot one and merging all of America's proxy wars into WW3. It will end the same as the Cold War ended. It will take time, but the combined economies of the West will continue to outproduce Russia by multitudes. At some stage the Russian war economy will crumble and after that Russia will implode and will break up into pieces just like the USSR did. History always repeats itself. Unfortunately it will come at the expense of great human suffering of diplomatic negotiations for authority, military strategies of authority, international interventions for authority dollar the willingness of all parties involved to seek peaceful solutions for all. Each of these factors plays an important role in determining the result of any conflict resolution. Final efforts. Half a year ago it would have been the border with Ukraine along the Dnieper the loss of three regions. Today everything is moving towards the fact that the border may be much further away. And Lviv will become the new capital. Unless some miracle happens, the Ukrainian army will be forced to retreat. But absolutely everyone will lose in this war. Best case scenario, frozen conflict along the current lines of control. Worst case, Ukraine capitulates from Western support drying up and loses everything east of the Dnipro. Absolute worst case, the Russian military makes its way to Kyiv. But the interesting thing is, I heard one analyst describe it. Wars often ends when the loser decides it's over. Russia will try one more offensive and conquer as much land as possible. Then will offer a peace deal. Already worn out Ukraine force by its allies will agree to it, provided China doesn't escalate it with Taiwan. In that case, whole of Ukraine will be incorporated into Russian Federation. This war is not exactly land fight, so Ukraine policy changes. Then will Russia stop at the East Ukraine? 
is will destroy Ukraine for not even their provides. I'm sorry for their young people lose. Russia has an important claim. They kinda broke the West Bloc countries' union. To situation like the Korean War where an international coalition from the West is required to drive them back. But when the West starts to gain the upper hand China will probably get more involved. Don't care. Out me being glib. It will end with no one caring. It will bleed away from the news and deals will eventually be made to end the conflict which will be lucky to make the first 10 pages of the newspaper. Cynical I know, but it's what I think will happen. We'll probably go one for years and years until Russian economy finally buckles a bit and the strain. Just like with Soviet involvement in Afghanistan, sanctions and war spending at the expense of the rest of the economy will slowly sat Russian will to continue the war. With freedom for all those poor suffering people, I will not let anyone hurt anyone in God's name anymore. The nations will unite and help their brother and sister across the globe. Enlightenment is here people why you're still ignoring it is truly astounding. It depends how long Johnson could do his ship will or not West send troops to Ukraine. In worst scenario front will fall apart very very quickly. In other cases there will be a lot of blood on both sides but Ukraine could survive as a country. Maybe. Russia has already lost. They have been the laughing stock of the entire developed world and now their one asset oil is basically worthless. Russia keeps fighting for now with no way forward or backwards No, it will topple in the next few years. Both have lost already in any meaningful sense. But given Western reluctance to supply Ukraine with what they need to be effective, Officially, I'd say what I've said from the start period victory for the Putin regime. Of Kremlin will get surrounded by foreign and domestic scientists. No way in and out quarantined. And the conclusion after investigating after quarantine is that. Yes, they truly are sadistic FCKS. Either Ukraine falls or Russia runs out of men and resources. Ukraine won't give up land and fight until the very end. Russia won't give up until Ukraine falls or gives up land. Afghanistan-style 20-year conflict. Even if Russia goes back to their country. Nah. You have lots of weapons that will inevitably get to guerrilla militias that will fight forever. Russia will take Kiev and then call for ceasefire. Wait 10 years, then repeat. The West and NATO will posture and use opportunity to increase funding and spending with no action. Ukraine will probably have to give up the territory that Russia currently occupies. The front lines aren't going to change much from here on out. Both sides are heavily dug in. Even if Russia annexes Ukraine completely, the Ukrainians will keep rebelling against them. So it's yet another pointless war that has destroyed at least one country. Probably with a disaster for everyone. But not for governments. Who will just shake hands and move on? I do not expect global war. But main shitstorm is coming. Russia is too proud to just leave. I'm hoping for a peaceful resolution somehow. I wish all these countries could just live and let live. Ukraine is running out of ammunition. So I think Russia has a better chance. But I hope not. There are rumours of peace talks. But not sure. Hopefully with Putin shooting himself in the head in a bunker. Hopefully that bunker won't be in a nuclear ravage hellscape. Russia will suggest peace and then go to reinforce an army for the next war with Ukraine. In a word a respite, it doesn't seem like everything will end with the capitulation of Ukraine. There are already some omens of this. Ukraine running out of manpower because Russia is so overwhelmingly large. Russia will unfortunately win. I just hate how they send soldiers to fight their battles. Why don't they just let their presidents go 1-1? One -one? This literal question gets asked every couple days. This has to be a bot training and AI at this point. It won't. It'll go on for another 800 years the way it's been going on for the last 800 years. Russia will likely get eastern Ukraine and the land bridge to Crimea and of course keep Crimea. Eventually, Putin will die of old age and Russia will suddenly stop caring about Ukraine. Russia will look for a way to withdraw that saves face as soon as the opportunity allows. Quickly, if Russia keeps losing aircraft at the rate they have been in the past two weeks, hopefully with the true character of Zelensky being brought to light. Evil little man. Russia gets some land back. Ukraine keeps some. It'll be a draw. Worthless war really. Russia will get to keep the territory it holds now. 
and Ukraine will be joining NATO. Russia will eventually conquer the entirety of it and then try to take Moldova. Ukraine loses after being used long enough as a meat shield or Putin dies, with America conquering both sides and manifesting a little more destiny. And, oh no, way too much corporate interest in this thing to have it end. I think everything will end simply. Bazinga's waiting for everyone. With the current Russian-held territory becoming, eventually the war will either end or evolve into something else. If Don the Con has his way, there'll be plenty of mine farmland. With Ukraine having to give up some land to Russia most likely, Ukraine is gonna be forced into giving up some of their land. I hope they just end peacefully. I tired of our governments. As Ukrainian, I think this will be a tie. Both will lose. Sadly, However, if Trump wins 2024, it'll end not goodly. In a completely shitty stall, with concessions by you are, by Putin growing a pair and pulling Hitler on Euro, Putin will die unexpectedly due to natural causes.